Hey guys, so this video we're going to take a quick look at these American Racing Torque Thrust D, I believe they're called, rims, and specifically the center caps, and even more specifically than that, the stickers for the center caps. So I've had these rims for 20-something years. I was 16, 22 years I've had these. I'll give you a quick story on it because I know you don't care, but you're going to hear it anyways. So I got these kind of from my sister. My first job was delivering pizza, and I was saving up to buy rims for the Caprice. I had uh, the rally rims like you would have on a Corvette and other cars back in the day is what was on these. But I wanted these American racing rims and I didn't have the money for it at the time, but I was doing this pizza delivery job. So my sister bought the rims for me and then I paid her back once I got the money from working at this pizza place. But I got them from Sears 22 years ago. Anyway, here's the thing. The video is about the center caps. So... My, I mean, these are dirty and dusty, but there's nothing actually wrong once, you know, I wipe away the dirt. Living on a gravel road, it doesn't take long for it to look like that. Um, there's nothing actually wrong with these center caps, but the stickers look terrible. You see, that's supposed to be red like this. So it's all just sun faded and everything. But the center caps themselves, and they're just plastic, they're expensive. If you just wanted to buy a set of four center caps, it's like crazy. And there's nothing really wrong with mine, especially once they're clean. So I got to look around. I thought, hey, you can just get the sticker because it's the sticker that looks terrible on mine. Now, if I go over to another one of these, and actually I was trying to think if I at one point replaced one because of my four center caps, that one looks pretty decent and the other three look like trash. So what are the odds that three would look terrible and one would look good? Makes me think I probably replaced it at one point. See now if we hold this sticker up, and by the way I got these on eBay and if the listing is still available I will um, I will put a link down below. So it is really close, obviously this is supposed to be red, that's sun faded out. Same thing with the star up there. The stars aren't right. They're like fat chubby stars instead of these like very straight line cut stars but the script which is surprising you got the text right for the script of the thing but you didn't get the star right so maybe american racing had different versions of this sticker but it is so close and these were super cheap it's a fraction of the price of just one cap and i think it's gonna make it look a lot better so I'm going to clean these real quick, and then I'm going to throw these stickers on. I mean, it's a sticker. Peel and stick. Boom. I'm not even going to take these old ones off. I'm going to do more of a pain trying to get these off. I'm going to go right over them, just clean it up first, and boom. I'll show you what they look like after. Yeah, look at that. That's a nice after right there. A lot better than the before. Like I cleaned up the whole thing a little bit, too. So you, you see that my stuff does clean up when I want it to. You know what I mean? It's not too shabby when it gets all cleaned up. A little spit shine. But really, I think that turned out really well. Hopefully they last a while, but I guess the worst they're going to do is fade and look like the other ones. And these were like super cheap, so you can just buy another set. Maybe buy a backup set just in case. But I think there were several people that had these things. Anyway, I'm real happy about that. Looks a little better. Because those things bugged me every time I looked down. They were all faded and blended in with the rest of it. So now look at that. Needs a bath. But things are coming together. We've done some good work lately on here. There it is. Thanks for watching.